My people, my people, it's about that time. Like a boss. Live from the USA, helping you get paid every day. This is the boss of Bitcoin, the Cristo of crypto. It's your boy BK. And if you don't like me, you must not like money. Thank you for joining me, everybody. Today we are doing our live uh, free Bitcoin giveaway. Uh, every Friday, I give you a chance to win free Bitcoin. All you got to do is leave a comment on any given video I do. Uh, so it's my chance to give back to the community. So if this is your first time tuning in, congratulations, baby. You are now rocking with the best. My name is BK, also known as the Crypto Trader. And I'm the boss of these charts, as you will soon find out. Every day I grace this microphone with my voice is another day you get to profit as a result and today is no exception. So if you haven't done it already, make sure you like and subscribe this video. I try to do a video seven days a week because the markets don't sleep and now it's time for you to get paid. So with that being said, uh, let's make it do what it do. Without further ado, let's make it do what it do. Let's go ahead and make this money. As I mentioned, we do give away free Bitcoin every Friday. Uh, it's payday, so I'm trying to help you get paid. Uh, back in the day, I would give away free BTC as an incentive for people to download a wallet, learn what a public key was, different things like that. Now, you know, a lot of people already done did that, so now it's really just a chance to give back and show love uh, when I can. So leave me a comment. Let me know what city in the world you calling in from, and uh, you will have a chance next Friday to win some free Bitcoin. So let's see what video we have. We do... We did six videos this week, so any number, one through six, let's see what it's going to be. Bam! Number five. Which one was that? That was early in the week. We go five from the top. One, two, three, four. Uncle Sam's Bitcoin. This was a good one. This is when we talked about the U.S. government having more cryptocurrency than most small countries. It's crazy. Like, put together. Like, people don't realize, like, they've seized uh, more than, I think, $11 billion worth of BTC. Um, and all they got to do is not sell it, and uh, soon they'll be able to pay off the national debt. But is that really their plan? You know, the more, the more I learn about this game, the more I think the government exists to put their citizens in perpetual debt and or fear... Um, you know, so that they're easier to control. But who am I to say such things? So let's go ahead and uh, pick a winner. Let's see. We did number six. Let's just go six from, the, or we did number five. Five from the top, right? Um, I'll be number one. One, two, three, four. Bam! My man from Slovenia. There you go. That's pretty cool. I shouted you out in a video. I said, we got people from Slovenia right now. So that's pretty amazing. <laughs> uh, there you go. Congratulations, brother. It's good to see you. Thank you very much for your love, for your support. I just said we global. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's like, it's like, it's like Khaled was back in the day. Like, we global. That's one of the most exciting things about cryptocurrency, about Bitcoin is it's not so much about, you know, jumping on and, you know, making a bunch of money and, you know, ne not necessarily helping nobody because I could do that. There's a lot of people doing that right now, but I, I really developed a mes methodology to change the world um, that's, that's built on top of the markets. It's like, you know, it's like an ocean, like the, the cryptocurrency market is like a new ocean, you know, and I got the best boat out there, you know, and I'm like, I'm giving people free rides. So again, um, this is pretty, uh, an amazing time to be alive. We're literally on the precipice of the greatest transformation of wealth in the history of humanity. Um, and we giving out money, uh, free Bitcoin to Slovenia. Like that's, that's, that's the, the world we live in right now. A couple clicks of the button and my man go has some free Bitcoin, you know, all the way up in Slovenia. So it's pretty amazing. Thank you again for your support. Um, I wanted to do a quick technical analysis on BTC cause I know it's been some discourse with regards to this last price drop. 
Uh, so I definitely want to touch on that real quick. So let's just look like basically this is the part of the cycle that we're living in. First, it's really two parts. And I, I don't want to go too much into, you know, the rhetoric uh, of this chart. But essentially, uh, this chart, we're completing our second cycle. That was the first cycle right there. Everything to the left of that line is basically the, um, you know, crypto boom 2017 alt season. Everything to the right of that line uh, up until, let's say, this point right here was the uh, Bitcoin breakout you know, 2020, 2021, that was like the COVID flash crash in, in 2020 where everything went down early part of 2020. But, you know, for the most part, Bitcoin has been the most resilient asset in the history of humanity. And now we're completing this third cycle. It's like a quick cycle. Um, this is probably just the first boom of it. Like if you're familiar with Elliott waves, this is like wave number two. Right, so if we're looking at this part of the chart, that's one, that's two. So number three is gonna be a big one. Let's just say that. Um, but we're completing that part, and actually number three is gonna just step up right here. Um, that's gonna be our capstone for that, like 81 to 95. But, um, so essentially it's like, these are the levels, and as long as we are above, This one, mm, yeah, it's the same level. It looked like 49, 41, 41, 50. We can leave it there, 49. As long as we're above this price right here, this is a rally continuation. Like Bitcoin has no reason to uh, stop going up. Um, this is one of the strongest continuation patterns I've seen in uh, Bitcoin's short lifespan. And that's because, and I've seen this in the early days of the chart, essentially we got our short-term moving averages right here, our quick and our medium. Both are relatively flat. Like that white, you know, for all sense and purposes over the past four months has been relatively flat. The blue, for all intents and purposes over the past couple months, relatively flat. This one, and that's the big money, the whales, oh, they gobbling it up. They gobbling it up. And in this case, all too often, we have a continuation to where basically the whales eat up the supply that the short-term sellers want to sell off, and this price has nothing but to do but continue to go higher, right? Um, the in industrials are huge on BTC right now. You got macro strategy, you got BlackRock, you got an ETF. You know, we actually have wealth generation vehicles for um, Wall Street built into the blockchain. So now, you know, and, and this has been the case, you know, for the better part of uh, 16 months now. Like these wells, they started buying. Let's see, when did they start buying? They started buying again down here at 20,000. So when Bitcoin was sitting at 18,000, finally broke 20,000, uh, that's when Winklevoss and all his boys uh, came in and said, oh, this is, a, this is the bargain of a lifetime. Let's buy this thing up. And so now we uh, definitely have what I think is a continuation pattern forming. But I think in the, in the uh, interim, I wanted to go into this guy now. And this is, yeah, this dude. No, uh, can't do a 33, but we could jump down to a 77. And uh, real quick, we could just do like trend line from top to top. Notice I'm going from our intermediate level, that's the blue line. And uh, you can just, you know, copy and paste this and put it on different um, occurrences in the chart, different points of inflection, basically. Right, so we got one right there. Got one right there. Another little one in the middle. And this basically gives you the channels running parallel throughout the chart that Bitcoin is subject to respond to, right? It's not perfect, but it does start to show 
you know, what's left with regards to support and resistance on this chart. And uh, top down, these are like red lines. Bottom up, these are green lines because these are areas where I think the market will start to buy back into Bitcoin because it did it once already. It literally bounced off of these levels, which meant we had more buyers and sellers. And uh, at the top, our levels where Bitcoin will have some suppression. So you see, we're getting relatively, even though we sold off, uh, you know, pretty big amount here over the past uh, couple weeks, we still are in, and that's what, 8%, which is nothing uh, in Bitcoin standards, but you know, people want to freak out about, uh, you know, a couple thousand dollars. Um, we still have a long way to go before we technically break out of this channel. So this is, uh, you know, it's really just water under the bridge. I don't I don't really, com you know, think there's anything to be panicked about. I just showed you on this daily um, that as long as we're above 50,000, the whales will continue to buy this asset. They have no reason not to. They haven't you know, shown disinterest at 26,000. They didn't show disinterest at 37,000. They didn't show disinterest at 49,000. So as long as we're above that level, you know, they're still making money hand over fist because you got whales that bought down here at 29, you know, that, that already doubled their money. And so uh, a little, a little, a little money off the top isn't going to scare them away. They're in it for the long haul. You know, this, this, this is a global currency at this point, um, and and I think the chart starts starts to show that uh, it's a fifty thousand dollar asset at minimum, right? Uh, upwards to one fifteen. Did I mention I was gonna show you how to make ten thousand dollars trading Bitcoin? Uh, this is uh, one of the new initiatives that I'm launching on this channel. I'm gonna invest three hundred dollars a month, and uh, we'll see how long it takes me to get ten bands of BTC. Um, there's something I did in the early days, like 2017, I actually invested 5,000, flipped that into 500,000. And now, uh, I'm just going to do 300 cause it's dollar cost average. And I think that makes it easier for every everyday people to participate. And I'm giving away these free trades to my, uh, SMS community, you know, text message, uh, boss. <laughs> no, you ain't got to do that. Just go to bossofbitcoin.com, type your phone number in there. Um, and I'm giving away the first trade this weekend. I know it's Friday. It's early in the month. I wanted to do this free Bitcoin video. But uh, this weekend, I'm going to buy my $300 in Bitcoin. And I'm going to be releasing the first trade to this community. So if you want to make some money with the boy BK, now's your chance. Boss of Bitcoin, sign up. And uh, we're going to keep this thing on wheels and keep on rolling. Shout out to my man Slovenia from Slovenia. Uh, congratulations to you. And now's your chance to win. You know, I do this every Friday, right? Um, it's, it makes me happy to get people to participate and, you know, to, to give them a reason to uh, get engaged with the community. So uh, leave your city in the comments. We're going to be back next Friday giving away some more free P BTC. All right? So with that being said, everybody, it's that time of the day. Signing out. Boss. Boy BK, no matter where you stay, Brazil to Bay or California, yeah. all the way back out through jerk money. Good night, good morning, and good day. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for your time. Hit that thumbs up button for a player one time. Do that for me if you appreciate mine. Till we meet again, stay cryptic, y'all. Peace. Like a boss. Huh. 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 Huh.